Hey Internet, I'm Color Forty, and welcome to the final episode of Mega Man Free. Because we are on Breakman, and after we beat Breakman, we will go to the Wily stages, and there is no saving in between those. So I'm gonna have to do these all in one video. I might split the video up into multiple parts, but this is it. Make it or break it. <laughs> Anyways, Breakman is just a boss fight, and it's just Proto Man. Oh shoot. I got jump and shoot mixed up. Yeah, you can really choose to, like, avoid his attacks or just kill him. Yeah, it says it's saving, but it doesn't save. My goodness, as soon as I got that last energy from Mega Man Wily, that Wily stole Gamma. No explanation for that at all. Ooh, why these saucers also a lot cooler in this one? More detail to it. Hey, eyebrows. And he gets a new skull castle. And welcome to Wily Stage 1. And okay, I just want to say, that's such a weird cutscene! There are no other cutscenes in the game, just that one. It's so weird. Something tells me I should have not chosen this GameCube controller to do this. Because the A button's kind of wearing down. Yeah, this is a very simple Wily stage. Also, energy tank, you'll probably want that. And underwater. A lot of easy enemies on this level. I say that now. No oh, thanks! <laughs> Warp pipes, too. It's time for hard knuckles. Yeah, hard knuckles can be used to clear out uh, walls that can be destroyed. Alright, let's get out Rush Jet, because I want that uh, energy. Energy tank, I should say. Because I'm going to want my Hard Knuckle later uh, in the Wily stages <laughs> for the boss fights, you know. Woohoo! This one's a good bit trickier. Ow. Fortunately, we can just fly right over him. <laughs> and everyone's favorite gimmick is back! I'll say it before- I've said it before, I'll say it again, I do not mind disappearing blocks. Let's see, uh, we can fill up on Rush Coil and Rush Jet. Never hurts. Alright, get out your Shadow Blade, kids! Also, I love this music. Oh no, evil turtle bots. Shadow Blade and Topspin one-hit kill them, though. And naturally, if I have a choice between Shadow Blades and Topspin, I'm picking the Shadow Blades. Why can't you be Metal Blades? And yeah, just kill the turtles and the main fiend uh, gets destroyed as well. And because you've got so many Shadow Blades, you really won't miss a couple of them. And these platforms are back. Beat's telling us to go this way. Is he correct in his directions? Yes, he is. Thanks, Beat. 
Whoosh! And we got the bear traps again. And we've got bees again. Basically, if the bee drops its, like, sack on you, it'll make, like, five little bees that'll all attack you. And it's very hard to shoot them all down, so... I prefer not to even give it that chance. Man! They're being very nice with the energy tanks. Which is good, because this is a tough boss. It's also a very short stage. You've seen this before! It's the Yellow Devil. To be more specific, it's the Yellow Devil Mark II. But since we can slide, it's a bit easier. I don't know. I haven't memorized its pattern like I have the first Yellow Devil. Ugh, it's the Yellow Devil. He's a real toughie. You're finished if you get hit by a block attack. Use Rush to dodge him. No. No. I'm, okay, I keep forgetting. If you push Start, you get that. Whereas if you push... Z, then you get this. I believe Shadow Blade's useful against him. At least I get warning this time. What the heck? Yeah. When he lumps together and then, like, sends himself bouncing across the screen, that's when you're in trouble. Because those are, like, nearly impossible to dodge due to their hitboxes being really wonky. Thankfully, this is a short enough stage. Oh, I should probably use energy tanks. I've got a ton of them. Yep, that's what happens. Only I scrolled two of the bees off screen. Hi, Buzz. Buzz Lightyear to the rescue! Yeah, that's what happens if you let all of them drop. And they home in on you, and they never go away, so... That's just not very fun to deal with. Seven energy tanks. Good grief. Why can't Rush Jet be this good in all the Mega Man games? I want to say Shadow Blade is useful against the Yellow Devil. Ah. Uh. Ooh, yeah. Shadow Blade's good. So, it's kind of debated which Yellow Devil is harder, this one or the original. I personally think this one's a lot harder. Yeah, like, look at that. I didn't even get hit by it, but yet I still technically did. I'm not gonna risk it, energy tank. And see, that's why I didn't risk it. <laughs> Yeah, that's a tough boss. Possibly the hardest boss in the game. Time for the third stage. With new music. Take Crazy Cannon. Take that. Actually, not Crazy Cannon. That's Mega Man 2. And I am such a nerd for knowing that. Man, they just hand out those fans like they're candy. Brilliant. I literally did not even know Rush could fall straight down in the ladder.
Oh, come on. That's like the one time Magnum Missiles have failed me. Wait a second. Why am I even killing him? There's nothing behind him. Thank you guys for having us help them, big guy. Phew. Instant death meets moving platforms. I love it. Not really. Well, I never say no to random power-ups. At least not in Mario Kart. Whoopee. Whoopee. Not sure if that was worth it, to be perfectly honest. Oh, that's right! Get out your search snakes. It's the Mega Man clones, and you have no idea which one is real. But when in doubt, it's the one on the top. Yeah, snakes just absolutely decimate these guys. I don't know why. It's just a funny thing that happens. Ooh, generosity! There's a reason for the generosity, though. I don't care if my Shadow Boys are running low. Hi! I forgot about you guys. They throw trash at you. Come on. And the junk froze itself, apparently. That makes sense. Hi, what the heck? The problem is they appear out of nowhere, so you have no idea that they're going to come out, and then they are going to deal a ton of damage to you. Boss time! Or should I say multiple boss time, because it's the teleporter room, and I don't remember which one is which. Of course. Why did I have to pick Needle Man? Darn it! If I had just hit him one more time, I actually would have beaten him. Okay, I do remember this is Shadow Man. Yeah, did you see how much my top spin went by, down by? I only used it like four times and I have like almost none left. Alright. <laughs> I'm not looking at you, Needle Man. You're a jerk. Stop abusing your needle cannon. I'm not abusing mine. Yeah. Top Man? Magnet Man. Oh boy. Spark Shock is really only good against Magnet Man. Other than that, it's pretty much useless. Hey, I guessed right. that, Gemini Man. Hi, Hard Man! You see, even if you're in the air, he still shakes the ground. Weesh. It's Top Man! Punch him to death. Uh. Okay, I was afraid the game had paused there for a second. That would have been bad. 
Oh yeah, I totally forgot about Spark Man. Well, guess what? I've got Shadow Blades now, so I don't fear you as much. Look, see, Shadow Blades do a bit more damage than the Needle Cannon did. Make sure you land on the HP so you actually get it. Which means, by default, the last fight has to be against uh, Snake Man. And the, the Needle Cannon really comes in handy. I don't know why snakes hate needles so much, but... They do. <laughs> and oh boy, new boss door. And new teleporter. Whoops, I should not have done that. Make sure you've got some hard knuckles. And it's the final stage. And amazing music right here. I need those hard knuckles. <laughs> And it's Dr. Wily. And he's weird in this. <laughs> Thankfully, the hard knuckles deal a hefty amount of damage. Alright, get out your rush jet. Okay. Let's go easy on the Wily. <laughs> yeah! Unfortunately, it's not quite the end yet. Mega Man has to run away. Beg for mercy! But what? It was Don Paolo in disguise the whole time! Now it's the final level. Thank you. Alright. I'll need some search snake. Some top spin. And in hindsight, I probably should have gotten some rush jet, but it's okay. Shadow blades for the first fight? It's Gamma. You know the thing Dr. Wily apparently stole? Just go right beneath him. And first form is dead. Unfortunately, that's only the beginning. No. No. Stop it! You can hit him with Search Snake, but it's really tough. To quote the first boss from uh, Star Fox 64, no. You could also use Top Spin. Come on! I hate how those bullets always shoot you off of his hand. Goodbye. Now beg for mercy. Don't make me spin into you. And now those junk robots are going crazy, and Wily died. And Mega Man died. Where's Dr. Wily? And then a mysterious ninja saves Mega Man. Oh no, too late. Epilogue! This has great plot, doesn't it, guys? <laughs> Mega Man, you've regained consciousness. I found you lying. I'm sorry, Dr. Light. I'll tell the truth next time. Here, when I arrive, I wonder who brought you here. This whistle! It must have been Proto Man! I made sure that Proto Man would whistle every time he moved around so you could tell where he was. Number of list of robots made by Dr. Light. Also, great music. Number 8, Black Man, Atomic Energy Controller. Number 7, Fire Man, Waste Disposal Robot. Number six, Bomb Man, Ground Disruption Robot. Number five, Ice Man, Arctic Investigation Robot.
Number four, Gutsman, Wilderness Reclamation Robot. Number three, Cutman, Timber Felling Robot. Number two, Roll, Housekeeping Robot. Number one, Mega Man, former assistant to Dr. Light. Now he does nothing. Number zero, Proto Man, new robot prototype, brother of Mega Man. Then why was he beating me up throughout the game? I never understood that. Like, Mega Man Free is really fun on all. Great game, amazing music, good graphics. But, darn it, the plot is terrible. Even Mega Man 2 had better plot. Because at least you could understand it. And we have Needle Man, Mega Man. Gemini Man. Alright, so that's uh, Mega Man Free. <laughs> As far as future Mega Man games go, uh, I honestly might not play 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, or 10. Just cause... 9 and 10 I can record, but they're also really, really hard, and I'm bad at them. 8 and 7, I just don't like. 8 I haven't even beaten, cause I can't get past the first YV stage of the whole jump, jump, slide, slide, Fane. Uh, Mega Man 7 I just thought was terrible. Like. I'm just going to put it like that. I hated Mega Man 7. Mega Man 6 was good, but... I don't know, the Wily stages and Mr. X stages were pretty bad. Mega Man 5, the Robot Master stages I liked, but then the Fortress stages were just terrible. Like, horrible. And then Mega Man 4, I just was not a big fan of. However, there is a Mega Man fan game out there that I definitely might consider playing, because... It's really good, but probably better than most of the official Mega Man games, in my personal, humble opinion. So I might be playing that later, like much later. I might even speedrun it, because I'm pretty good at speedrunning it now. I'll have to get back into practice, but... It'd be cool to make a speedrun video. Presented by Capcom. And this is back in the days when credits were really short, you know? Like, The Legend of Zelda, the first one, the credits are like two minutes, maybe. They were really short. And it boots me back to the Mega Man Anniversary Collection. Woohoo! Alright, so that's Mega Man Free. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie, and I hope to see you for my next Let's Play. Have a great day, and God bless.